Hi, I'm Fred, and just how much kinetic energy can we reasonably expect to get from an arrow or a musket ball? Well, let's find out. Hey, Russell. Hi. So I was just going to ask you, why did the Powhatan choose to use um, the arrow points that they did, and why did they make their arrows the way they did? So the Powhatan and uh, most other Eastern Woodlands tribes are going to have a variety of different arrow shafts and points because you're using it for different things. I like to tell people you're not going to hunt a bear with birdshot if you want to be around for long today. And so the Powhatan will have simple sharpened or blunted arrows, primarily out of hardwoods like oak and hickory, for small game. You can hit squirrels and rabbits, that kind of thing, because of its durability. You'll move into softer and lighter woods, and sometimes cane, tipped with bone points, primarily for birds and fish, maybe for warfare and kind of medium game. And then you'll see these stone points that people commonly think of um, really being used mostly for big game and warfare. Generally on a light a shaft as you can get away with, a really thin down um, light wood like viburnum or poplar, um, and commonly river cane, which is kind of endemic in the southeast, very useful material, much like bamboo. 400 even. Mm -hmm. There you go. So oh, wow. Fred, thank you for joining me today. Oh, you're welcome. I just wanted to ask you, what kind of bullet are you going to be using for this matchlock musket? How much does it weigh? How big is it? Uh, 318 grains. All right. Well, that gives All us right. some pretty decent hard data to work with. 6-0. Well, that's good because we used a 6-0 round ball mold to cast it. So All that right. tells us the mold's doing a great job. <laughs> As we can see, a 400 grain arrow at 112 to 117 feet per second can develop about 11 to 12 foot-pound force, and a 60 caliber 318 grain bullet can develop about 689 to 694 foot-pound force. If you like this video, remember to like, subscribe, and leave a comment below.